you can use other other baits with a punch shot but this uh this thing right here is uh it's a lot of a lot of beef to it so i want to make sure i can i can set the hook hard but uh high speed reel is key 17 uh, you know six, 14 to 16 18 pound test somewhere in there is what you want on the fluorocarbon around wood but uh we're just going to pitch it whoa we gonna try that again So as we're gonna as we're gonna turn to fish this thing, uh, we're just gonna just gonna make a pitch to the cover, and once it gets down there in the cover, we're gonna keep our line a little tighter than we would for a for a Texas rig because that weight is a little heavier than we probably would with a Texas rig. Instead of having one one quarter ounce weight or one three eighths ounce weight, we've got two of them on there to keep that bait closer to the bottom because our 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 bait is actually above the bottom the weight's going to be on the bottom weights weight's going to be below so we're just going to kind of shake and hop and drag that thing on a tight line and believe you me when they hit it you will actually feel it really well so that thing you're just going to kind of drag it along drag it along you, i can feel it coming over that cover that i can see in the water and then when i do get a bite boom i get that bite i'm going to reel down reel all my slack up and then just kind of ease get a get a good hard hook set in it and then you're just gonna gonna reel them in hopefully but i'm gonna pitch to some of this other cover around here and see see what we can come up with let that thing go down to the bottom then as i said reel up the slack more than you would with a uh, more than we would with the texas rig and then you're just going to kind of drag that thing maybe give it a little hop but uh, that punch shot comes through cover really really well you think with all that all that terminal tackle attached to that thing that it wouldn't but man it really does it comes right through the wood comes through matted vegetation comes through a lot of stuff really well i'm gonna keep fishing it here for a few more minutes and see what what i can come up with got another another little shallow target right here just working it real slow and you can feel, because it's got that heavier weight on it, you can feel the bottom really well. You can tell if you're in gravel, coming over limbs. Uh, you can tell if you're on sandy bottom. It's, it doesn't feel like much right there. I'm just dragging it along, doesn't feel like much. So I'm gonna reel it in, pitch over here to this shallow cover. Little limb right over there. Seesaw it on the other side of that limb. bring it over top of it and then just I brought it over top of that limb so I know that's that's, a, that's an area where the fish could be so I'm gonna just kind of kind of shake it on a tight line just a little bit not really moving the bait much it's giving the, the the bait itself a little quiver in action nothing happens you're just gonna may drag it along a little further got it away from the cover so then I'm gonna go right back out to the next target 